everybody and welcome to the daily scope 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 for the 8th of august so today we've got the moon's north node going retrograde mercury making a sister quadra to the moon's north node at 10 54 and the moon entering its last quarter moon phase as well so mercury sister quadra to the moon's north node which happens when mercury and the moon's north node are 135 degrees apart symbolically because astrology is a symbolic language to explain the ethereal um, in a logical kind of way so yeah mercury sister quandra moon's north node can make us crave intellectual stimulation and also allow us to you know have breakthroughs in our thought processes or just have deep conversations with others as well and we may um, seek new knowledge and or expand the understanding of the world and the people in it it's good energy to use for research and learning or engaging in meaningful conversations but be mindful of becoming too mentally scattered or overwhelmed by information overload so it's good for research in, but just be careful because sometimes I can be guilty of it as well you know sometimes I have five books in my hand at once you know like just try and chill out of it the moon also enters its last quarter moon phase so you can check out the playlist to know more about that but in general this allows us to reflect on our goals and intentions or should be used for this to re-evaluate our progress and make any necessary changes that we need to do as well when the moon's north node goes retrograde and it goes retrograde quite a lot um, the moon's north node that's it it explores us it normally stays there for a couple of days but anyway it invites us to explore our spiritual path and reconnect with our true purpose and it wants us ultimately to listen to our intuition and to if we sometimes you know our negative thinking can get in the way of intuition I've been there when it's like well I can't trust my intuition because sometimes it sounds good and then one minute it's telling me crazy stuff so normally when that happens we have to just slowly be gentle with ourselves, and it can take years you know just to unpack that and to heal our trauma so we can trust our true intuition and it's normally just a quiet voice it's not a crazy one that you know just you know so you can distinguish between your unresolved trauma and your intuition by thinking is this voice just still and quiet and just single in its message or does it keep on changing its message and stuff and normally when it's that it's our overthinking and logic and also our past trauma and stuff like that but ultimately the moon's north node in retrograde wants us to look into our hidden desires and our longings urging us to embrace our authentic selves and heal our inner child and to reflect on our spiritual beliefs or lack of them and explore new practices and also you know it's a good time to connect with like-minded individuals who can support and inspire you on your path as well so ultimately today's astrology aspects is a combination are a combination of intellectual stimulation releasing and reflecting and deepening our spiritual connection and connecting with ourselves and others on a deeper level as well also content creators can use this energies of today to create content about how to find our authentic self-expression how to improve our communication skills and different strategies and how we can improve continue our personal growth and exploration and the barriers to doing so and how people can do so safely and how important it is to have this number one relationship with yourself and a higher power whatever that is to you to some people it's a pair of suits you know that's their higher power live and let live uh, for others it's trees it's nature itself it's uh, a god it's a religion you know whatever you know a higher power is to you giving tips on how to become closer with that and to understand and knowing that ultimately despite what we've been told by maybe our cultures and stuff it's a loving force that just wants us to be our best selves not because it needs us to be but because we want to be so yeah uh, <laughs> that's the daily scopes 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 for the 8th of august <laughs>